I have kicked everybody out of my area today because I'm going to be doing this video and I don't want anybody around. <music> It's Crystal here with A Broke Plant Eater. Welcome back if you're a subscriber. And if you're not a subscriber, you should be subscribing. There is a subscribe button in one of these little areas. I don't know. I'm doing a front facing camera so that I can kind of make sure that there's nobody sneaking in in the background here. Today is our second episode of Yo! Try This, which is a collaboration between my buddy Gene over at The Basic Vegan Yes, if you watched episode one, I pronounced his name wrong only because we text and message each other and I just read his name and then I finally listened to a podcast that he was featured on and he said his name and I was like, dude, I am so sorry. Why didn't you tell me that I said your name wrong? But apparently it's a common mistake. So I apologize again publicly. Anyway, today's episode two of Yo Try This. Yo Try This is all about trying new things, new products, new snacks, new foods that you might not have tried because you were hesitant, whether it was price or whether it was just kind of like, I don't even know if I'm gonna like this. I don't wanna, you know, try something like this. Maybe it's just not in your range, but then you have this other person that um, is a friend of yours that is like, dude, no, it's good. You should totally try it. So all of your taste buds start to change if you've been plant-based or vegan or any plant-based type of person. So that's what these episodes are all about. I have given him an item, he has given me an item. We are going to talk about what he has given me. It is these almond milk chocolate pudding cups made by Zen. Um, they're organic, they're made with almond milk, um, they're soy free, dairy free, gluten free. They were $1.99 for four of them, which I think is about the going rate for jello pudding. I don't know, I haven't bought it in a really long time um so guys if I like this I'm gonna be like really scared because then I'm gonna be going back to my childhood where all I ate were like pudding cups and they were delicious and then I'm gonna be spending all my money on these damn things but um then the kids can finally have some pudding cups that I don't I don't feel bad about giving them they are let's just go over some of these facts here there are 120 calories per cup, 2.5 milligrams fat, uh, only 50 grams of sodium. There's 23 carbs, which is a lot, but it's a snack, it's a treat, it's not all the time, unless I like them because they're so delicious. Um, there's 17 grams of sugar, only one gram of protein, but made with really good things like organic almond milk, organic cane sugar, organic uh, cornstarch, organic cacao powder, uh, natural flavors, um, organic sunflower oil, evaporated salts, and organic lotus bean gum. Mm. All right, so I'm going to give these a try and see how we like them. You guys, I'm kind of scared because if these are really good, I'm gonna be, I have found these at Whole Foods, by the way. If they're really, really good, I'm gonna be going back and getting more. It. For me to have these, I had these for about a week in my fridge before I did this video, and I had to like hide them behind um, bread, like this sprouted bread that Scott and I eat, that the kids don't eat. Um, I had to like hide it behind there, and I think I put uh, some cauliflower next to it. Um, so that's the only reason why these things lasted in this house, because we have four kids. So, do you see this? This... This smells like legit jello chocolate pudding. All right, first things first, you can definitely tell that this is like cacao powder and not like Hershey cocoa powder or milk chocolatey powder. It is definitely like a nice dark bitter chocolate that I'm getting. It's really good. It's really good end result I'm gonna have to go back and buy more there's no aftertaste I wish I had like some of that coconut whipped cream that I used to buy in the can but we don't have any that would taste so good on here now I can put this in my lunchbox and eat the entire damn thing in like two seconds 
I haven't had chocolate pudding and I don't even know how long. I usually make like chia pudding, but this is where it's at. Hell yeah. You know what? I'm gonna have Scott come down here and try this because he loves sweets. So he's gotta try this. Hang on one second. Babe! Wait, have you had like, when's the last time you had a pudding cup? It's been a long time. <laughs> a long time? Yeah. Nice, but this is what I'm supposed to do. All right, so what is it? Does it smell like chocolate pudding? It smells like chocolate pudding. Like it automatically made me feel like I was, it was like a pudding cup. Like the jello pudding cup. Okay, can I just dive in? Oh, you can, I started it around a little bit. It's good. Okay. Not quite bad for you cow milk pudding. Right. But there's no pus in this. <laughs> so that's really good. <laughs> right. This is pus free. It, it is. That's so I said it has like a dark chocolate like bitter because it's not milk chocolate. It's cacao powder. Yeah. So. A little bitter. But it's just not as um, <gasps> dense. What do you mean? Like, so it's like a lot fluffier or? I guess. I don't know how to explain it. It's not the same consistency of regular milk pudding. Well, if, I mean, if it's not the same, then you don't have to finish the pudding. I won't eat it. You don't waste pudding. What do you think would make it better? Oh, it's perfectly fine. There's nothing wrong with it. It's just not the same. Do you think a kid would eat it? I think somebody who like hasn't had like a chocolate pudding cup longer than you, like me, it's like really appreciating that pudding I'm cup. really appreciating it too. I'm going to eat the whole thing. Yeah, I just wish it was like maybe a little creamier. But creamier. It's good. That's good. Yeah. It's good. It's just not... It's you know, very good. I would eat it again. I would totally eat this. I think it would taste like really good if it had like coconut milk to get the creamy flavor. But then I think people are scared it's going to taste like a chocolate coconut. Whipped cream. That whipped cream would have been nice. Yeah. I already said that. I wish we had some of that. Should I try it again with another cup to see if it tastes the same? No, I think all of them taste the same. Are you sure? I'm pretty sure they all taste the same. Oh, I have to get, I'm gonna get what I told him he has to try, which I already ate one of, sorry. All right, so here is the brand that I've asked him to try. He's never had anything that was this Hail Mary. That's amazing. These are Meyer lemon cups, so I've already eaten one. So they kind of look like, and delicious. This tastes a lot like, this one tastes a lot like coconut. I hope they didn't change their recipe since I asked him to try them. So what I think is funny is it has all of these like labels on the front and then they like hide the vegan label all the way in the back. Almost like they're scared somebody's not gonna wanna eat it if it's vegan. But it is also gluten-free, dairy-free. It's non-GMO, which is awesome. Um, they're not organic, and the dog just moved this thingy. But they have some really good ingredients. Uh, most of it's organic. Um, so, yeah, let's see what he says about these. I'm going to link his video in the description box. I will also link or try to link his little subscription bubble next to my bubble at the end of this video. I'm not sure if I'm gonna be successful in that. I'm still new, but head over to his channel, check him out. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. If you are not following me on Instagram and Facebook, head over there and definitely, definitely link up there as well. Until next time. No, it's okay. Basically this, um, the, I'm rambling. You are rambling a little bit. Babe! I love how the dogs come running first. Is it time for my shot? Give me my spoon. Automatically made me feel like I was, it was like a pudding cup. Like the jello pudding cup. Don't say jello pudding. <laughs> It is. It's not quite. I can't use any of them. I'm gonna have to like bleep you out for everything.
We're gonna see if I'm gonna leave you in or not. Once I'm done editing. Really? Yeah.